Hello everyone and welcome to the series of lectures on Python programming language offered by Anigra Academy. So today we'll look at the tuples in Python. So let's like have a look at our today's agenda. We'll first of all look at what are tuples in Python, examples of tuples in Python and the methods or functions of tuples. So what are tuples in Python? A tuple is an immutable sequence of Python objects. Tuples are sequences just like list. The difference between tuples and list are that tuples cannot be changed, unlike list and tuples use parentheses, whereas a list uses square brackets. Okay, so here is an example of tuple. I have written the code tuple one is equals to apple, banana, cherry, and uh, cherry. And so here, this is the parentheses for tuples. And if you will print it, you will get the output as apple, banana, and cherry. So these are the tuple methods and functions. You can create a tuple. You can find the index um, index of the tuple, that is accessing of the elements, accessing the items, slicing of tuple, concatenations of two uh, or multiple tuples, reputation of tuples, membership, and comparison. Moreover, you can uh, do these two functions with tuple. Uh, this is a count method, which returns the number of times a specified value occurs in a tuple, and indexing searches the tuple for a specified value and returns the position of it where it is found. So let's have a look at all of them in our PyCharm. So here I have opened my PyCharm and I have declared a tuple that is apple, banana, cherry and mango. So let's print this tuple. So here we get the output apple, banana, cherry and mango. So let's uncomment this. So here I have declared another tuple and in order to find uh, which element is present at this particular index, we'll pass this index into tuple. So here I have passed two, so it will tell which element is present at index two. So let's run this. So tuple also index is uh, in tuple, index also start from zero. So apple is at zero, banana is at one and cherry is at two. So uh, we get the output two. Let's uncomment this. So here I have, I have also declared another tuple and we are do, been doing slicing on the tuple from 1 to 3. So apple is present at 0, banana is present at 1, uh, cherry is present at 2 and mango is present at 0. So in the, uh, in this, in the tuple, the slicing is also done as in the list. So if you slice from 1 to 3, so it will give banana and cherry only because it will exclude the, third in, the, the element present at third index. So let's uncomment this. So here I have declared another tuple, tuple 1 and another tuple that is 3, 6 that is tuple 2 and I am doing the concatenation of tuple 1 and tuple 2 that is adding both of these tuples. So it will generate a new tuple and the answer will be this, apple, banana, cherry, mango and 3, 6. If you want to replicate them or uh, multiply them, you can also do it by multiplying with a number. So I have declared an, as a tuple that is tuple 2 is equal to strawberry and I'm multiplying it three times. So let's run this. So I have got three uh, strawberry three times. So here I have another tuple that is apple, banana, cherry, and mango. And we will check if the cherry is present in tuple one and if the strawberry is present in tuple two, that is membership. So true and false, uh, that is cherry is present in tuple 1, that is true, and strawberry is present in tuple 1, that is false. So here we are comparing two tuples. I have declared tuple 1 is equals to 1, 2, 3, and tuple 2 is equals to 1, 2, 3, and we are printing if both of these tuples are equal. We are comparing both of these tuples, so it answers true because both of these are true, both of these are equal. If I say that they are not equal, it will turn false because they are both equal. So here I have declared another tuple that is 1, 3, 7, 8, 7, 5, 4, 6, 8, 5. So I am checking here how many times this 5 is present in this tuple. So I will pass it in the function that is count function. So it will count how many times this 5, this five is present in this tuple. So let's run this. So here I have got 2 because it is present in, uh, 2 times here is 1 and here is the second time. Here's a, here I have another example of uh, tuple. Here I am finding the index of mango, like which index the mango, the word mango is present. 
So it's zero for apple, banana for one, cherry for two, and mango for three. So let's see. So here I've got three because this mango is present at index three. But as we know that tuples are non-changeable, we can't change the values of tuples. So uh, if I'm if I want to change the value uh, present at index two from this uh, cherry to kiwi, it will throw me an error. That is, a tuple object does not support item assignment. You can't change the values of tuple. Tuple. So let's remove this. And here I have the last example. Okay, in this print statement, after the tuple, you can press this uh, dot and you will get all the methods applicable for tuples. Okay, so that's all for today. Thank you very much for watching us. Please take up some time to subscribe to our channel, kindly like the video and share with your friends and comment your queries in the comment section below. Goodbye, see you soon.